Well, I recently bought a cello and it was a huge decision. You know, I first looked into renting them. They were incredibly expensive. And I thought, well, why don't I just buy a cheap one? I've never played the cello before. I've never actually played a strong string instrument with a bow before. Although I am, uh, you know, I, I grew up with music, so I'm very familiar with, uh, with notes and reading music and, and, and those type of things. And it's always been a big dream of mine to play the cello. So I just bought one. And if you find them, if you look them up on Amazon, they're really not that expensive uh, for a cheap one. Lots of people will probably argue that they're not very good. I don't know. I don't know the difference probably because I don't know how to play it. It just showed up uh, a couple days ago. It's the first chance I've really had to sit down with it. And my first impression is, is essentially that it's great. Um, I couldn't be more excited about it. Again, I wasn't looking for a, you know, an expert cello. Um, my first impression again is uh, everything was there. Nothing was broken. Uh, so if you're worried about that, then um, don't be. Uh, and they have a good return policy if, if you do have problems. It came on time. I think it took four or five days to actually get here. Uh, some of the things, I think the finish could be a little bit better. It seems to be a little bit spotty in some places. The pegs were a little bit loose and hard to tune the first, first time that I tried. But I think they take a little bit, you know, pushing in there, um, pushing into a thing, just playing around with it and get it. The purpose of this video is to help other people that were in my similar situation that want to know whether or not it's worth it to buy a cello. And hopefully you can get a little bit more insight from this video and the videos to come. I want to document my progress every month, well at least every month, over the course of a year or two years or so. Uh, that way I can show... I guess I can keep myself accountable, but also help others who are interested in, in pursuing the cello, uh, maybe as an adult or, or a teenager, that might be in the same position as I am, uh, being musically uh, inc inclined and knowledgeable, but maybe have never touched a cello before in their life. So figuring out the rosin, I figured out you had to put rosin on the bow. That's how new I am really to the cello. Uh, I first tried to you know, crank on the strings after I got it tuned and nothing happened so I had to get ro the rosin and actually broke my first rosin and I have no idea what I'm doing but I'm having fun and I, and I enjoy it. Uh, I guess I'll let you uh, hear what it sounds like. I think I have it tuned. Maybe maybe not quite perfectly but this is this is what it sounds like. We have the C string. Mm -hmm. So again, I've never played the cello, I've never played the violin, I really haven't even held one up close to tell you the truth, but it's always been a dream of mine to, to buy one, to play one, to learn how to play, and I figure what better chance to do it than, uh, than, than right now. So I was really debating whether to get this or the Xbox, or Xbox One um, to spend whatever time I, I don't have, I guess any extra time, and uh, ended up getting this, and I'm glad I did. So that's kind of my idea is document every month or so my progress by playing a song. Um, and so, yeah, if you check it out, if you want, you can follow me. You can see how I go, and that will keep me accountable as well. Um, so I would just encourage anybody else, if you have doubts on whether you should buy the $200 cello on, on Amazon, go ahead and buy it. You're really not going to regret it. Uh, you might regret not buying it and learning how to play. Uh, that's kind of my philosophy about it. So um, I do. I think I learned how to play a scale. So I'll play one scale, and then we'll call it. We'll call it a day. So here, here it is.
obviously, I, I'm hoping to get a lot better over the next couple weeks and months. So, uh, anyways, thanks for checking out the video. If you liked it, you can go ahead and, and uh, like it or follow me below. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'm excited to, to start learning.